Yo, what's going on, guys? We are back. We're halfway through, boys. We made it to Wednesday, and it's Wild Card Wednesday. We finally got power ups. We maybe didn't get all the power ups that we wanted. Everyone's kind of speculating that more programs and things are coming. So hopefully, we get some good stuff coming, but. You guys know the deal, boys. I want all the energy and good vibes still. Once again, man, hope everyone has a great day. We're going to jump into some stuff. Check out the Wild Card Wednesday. Flip some packs. Kind of just see what the news and Kralos talking about this morning. Probably going to be a low-key chill video this morning. Been working on a Giants theme team that is going to be a new series that once again that we're going to probably be really really working on next year in Madden 22 but wanted to kind of get some ideas going get some things going today started building a giant theme team so probably continue doing that today maybe start a little video and a small kind of series on that today so if you guys want to see that man comment down below let me know maybe some giant theme team stuff some gameplay some things like that as a second video today let me know what you guys think. But we're about to jump into it, boys. Greatly do appreciate everyone, man. If you are new, hit that sub button, man. If you enjoy the videos, drop a like. We're almost to 100,000 subscribers, boys. 99,000 next. Let's check out and see what we got today. Need some coins? MMO EXP. Yes, they are real. No. They aren't instant, no one is, but they are reliable and the cheapest around. Use code SCOMO for 5% off. Get you some coins, stack your team, get those dubs, boys. Yay! Wild Card Wednesday is live. My chat's giving it L's. We saw the stuff kind of last night. CC chimed in with it with his tweet. We had RG this morning kind of going over everything. And I mean, you, you could see him all right here, boys. Like, these are the ones that we got. Not exactly the lineup that we were looking for right we got the 92 overall campus heroes power-ups obviously there's a huge list of other power-ups that we really really wanted within the community now ea always feels like there's a reason why they do stuff not that we agree with the reason or even like the reasons but they have reasons that they do stuff and it's almost so obvious that they did the power-up program like this it would have just been a lot better hey we haven't dropped power-ups in a few weeks it's been almost like a month and a half really since we've dropped power-ups last time we're like five programs behind here's like 100 power-ups which would have been super, super dope, but they're not gonna do that. There's a few things that we would have liked from this, giving us a, a few more of the programs added into it. The problem that's scaring us all a little bit and that CC talked about and that I've seen other people talk about is either A, are they gonna give us more programs that where these cards are gonna get upgraded? B, if they make the power-up thing a continuous thing where they give us these power-ups, they have to be more consistent they can't just give us new power-ups every eight weeks because by the time they give us the power up for that card it's almost too too late one thing that was really really good and i i would love them to start doing if you guys remember last year when they did the power up upgrades where maybe not everyone just got new cards but they just started upgrading all the power ups i hope we get to a point with that where they just give us a bunch of power-ups maybe power-ups that we don't have in the game yet along with power-ups that are in the game that maybe just get update little power-up path updates to give them those boosts we need the team of the year ones we need the super bowl power-ups we need the playoff power-ups we need team of the year power-up we need the um the black history month uh power-ups i think we got the aussie right i love that they gave us power-ups i love the power-up challenges also so if you're looking to get some of these power-ups don't rush buying these power-ups off the market right now you know there's people that are gonna be pulling some or diving into these solos really really fast to try to get the cards on the market and there's gonna be people that are gonna spend way too much you can go through these things and get 15 stars these are uh like half game moments, fourth quarter moments these are not full games so fourth quarter fourth quarter fourth quarter fourth quarter you do all of these and you will get you get three power up just complete these solos which is going to give you a power up fantasy pack of all the new power ups in the game today don't don't spend too much extra coins on these things man you get two of them and six options so you get like multiple options in each one it's a fantasy pack but you get multiple selections in each ones right that is going to be the major major concern it's the consistency of these things especially wild card wednesday with the power ups right if 
they skipped flashbacks or they skipped heavyweights or they skipped campus heroes or they skipped rising stars or they skipped one of those and gave us those like every six or eight weeks and they were like hey we need to do more power-ups then that would make more sense but the fact that like Tex just said the last time we got wild card Wednesday for power-ups was October 14th if they wait until like june to give us more power-ups again that's just gonna be such an l it's gonna be such an l I, I wouldn't even be mad if next wild card wednesday was just power-ups again right like am, am i just stupid to think that like am i wrong would you guys rather have more power-ups next one wild card wednesday or would you rather have flashbacks heavyweights vet or like one of those guys uh, i'm pretty sure rather than having new cards at this point for wild card wednesday we want new cards we want new programs we want players to get upgrades we want that kind of stuff both is always a good thing we're not gonna get we're not gonna get both i think i i personally would rather have power-ups for cards that we have to make the cards that we have more useful than give me some more mid-range card we don't want vet the flashbacks eh there's been a few good cards that have come out of some of these wild card Wednesdays the last few days. What we get like a, a Darnell Savage like two weeks ago or something that was really, really good. There was a few cards that come out on wild card Wednesday that are good. But the big thing that we need at this point of the year is wild card Wednesday and the power ups to keep up with the programs that we're getting in the game. There's no reason why we should get a new card in the game that we want or that could be potentially really good for our team, but have to wait three months to consider using him again because to get that power up that's where i think the frustration for the entire community comes ea needs to understand and prioritize not based on their plans but based on what the community is literally telling them and screaming at them that this is what we want you know for a fact there's people in the office like i bet they're happy man finally maybe they'll shut up we gave them their power-ups like no we're not gonna shut up you didn't even give us the power-ups that we want and i think that's where the frustration comes in for the community is we want a game is so dominated on power-ups and chems and getting the right abilities and thresholds and what archetypes and all that kind of stuff is. They built the game like this. We can't wait three, four months to get a power-up for a card from a program three, four programs ago. The game is not designed to do that. So they're all 80 overall power-ups, right? All right, so I do see a few new power-ups up there. Tim Tebow is one of the new ones that just got a power-up, correct? Is Keyshawn Johnson another one that just got a new one? I think those were new ones, if I'm correct. I'm trying to look here. So like, once again, 26K trying to buy that right now. Like, you could just play the solos. I, I was wanting to see if there was anyone trying to like really sneak in like 100k or something for these power-ups or something like that I wish they gave us like a power-up roller or something, you know, that's almost like what we need at this point I guess you can get power-ups out of this and if you're gonna be rolling I want to keep your eye out for some of the new power-ups or something like that that comes out of that and don't quick sell those We're gonna do a few rolls here. See if we can get maybe a power-up pink redux back-to-back -back 90s i can't believe i'm rolling these things and actually want a power up now since we actually want a power up we're not gonna get a power up let's see if it'll actually give me one of the new ones bro give me one of the new ones no nope. green redux watch me get a green redux when i'm trying to get a power up right <laughs> nah it is it is what it is rg was definitely trying to gas us up you know and i mean rg doesn't fully know like he's not a big mutt guy he's not in on all the content you know, he pays attention to the community. He watches Twitter. He pays attention to the comp scene and knows like what those guys are talking about. And, and he knows, he knows that these were not the power-ups that we were looking at to get the abilities and the archetypes and get all the stuff that we want to get to get that next level ability. But I don't know, maybe they did tell him something. Maybe they gave him a little bit of information saying like, hey, these things are gonna be coming next Wednesday also. But I think the biggest thing that we are nervous on, like Tex was saying here in the chat, is that one of the new ones? That is not one of the new ones. Is if they're gonna give us wild card Wednesday for power-ups, we want power-ups. Do not make us wait another like two, three months until we get another group of power-ups if they do that it's gonna be such an l i would love to a point where guys remember they used to do the power up uh path upgrade thing on sundays that would be cool 
Like, just give us a bunch of power-ups every Sunday again. They did that. That'd probably make a lot of people happy. Give us a little content on Sunday. And then just give us all the power-ups that we want. There's no reason why anyone in the game over like a 90 overall should not have a power-up at this point, man. They did give us elite packs. Oh, no. One elite pack for the tube. Let's see what we can get. Tomorrow, we'll at least have limiteds. Hopefully, we get some good limiteds. We will roll the variety packs and see if we can continue our luck with limiteds. We're going to do a little gameplay later on tonight, boys. See you then.